Hey Diego. Uh who who's my anchor partner? Second, well, who do we know who has bucket hats? I've arrived. But Russell, you're not part of our TV. What are you doing? It's bucket hat day. I'm shh, shh, shh. Russell, I'm serious. Shh, 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 shh. Uh, good morning, Hart. I'm Russell. And I'm John. Today is Friday, March 24th. And today we are celebrating... Uh, what are we celebrating? Buckethead Day! But I thought Buckethead Day was in September. Who cares? Let's just take the moment to appreciate the beauty and elegance that is Buckethead Day. Alright then. Uh, so Russell, how many Bucketheads do you even have? I have no idea. Let's check. Way too many to count. Why do you have so many? Well, my philosophy in life is you can never have too many bug hats. Sounds like a sound philosophy. Please stand for the pledge. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Here's your weekend weather update with Koa. Good morning, Art. Today, on this beautiful day, is a high of 59 and a low of 39. It is going to be sunny. Tomorrow is a high of 58 and a low of 37. It is also going to be sunny. And Sunday, it's going to be a high of 60 and a low of 36. Would you have guessed it? It's also going to be sunny. I'm Koa Bocato reporting for RTV. Back to you in the studio. Here is ASB with some important information about today's rally. Hey Hart, for our rally today, you can pick what side you want to be on. So if you pick fire, enter on the right side of the gym. And if you pick ice, enter on the left. We hope to see you all there at brunch today. March is also Social Workers Month. Hart TV's very own Catherine Montenegro caught up with our school's social workers to find out more about her job. Hey Hart, March is Social Workers Month, so we're going to be interviewing Miss Mario, our school's clinical social worker. So, Ms. Mario, tell us a bit about yourself. Well, I am a clinical social worker, for one, um, and I went to school here at Hart as well as Placerita, and I attended CSUN for my bachelor's and my master's degree. And what does an average day in your job look like? Oh, um, I would say that there's no average day. I think every day is different, which is why I love my job. I get to help with mental health and resources and attendance. So every day looks a little bit different. Sometimes it can be a lot of meetings. Sometimes it's just meeting with students all day. So it depends. And what's something unique about your job that not many people really know of? Oh, I would say that I have the ability to do um, therapeutic mental health services, for sure. I also get to advocate for government change, as well as advocate in your own community to go ahead and um, get resources for all of you. So that's something that's cool about my job. I think also about just social work in general, that there's so many different types of social work, right? I know sometimes there is a fear, right, of social workers, but what I do working in a school, it's primarily for mental health resources and helping with attendance. And lastly, what do you like most about your job? Honestly, I love that I get to work with all of you and that I get to work at the school where I went to and this is my community. So I think honestly that's been my favorite part. Thank you. This is Catherine Montenegro reporting for Heart TV. Back to you in the studio. And now, the news. Boys Volleyball take on Castaic. All games are at Castaic. Frosh and JV play at 4.15, and the varsity game starts at 5.30. Baseball goes up against Saugus. JV play at Saugus at 4, and the varsity game is right here at Hart at 3.30. And on Saturday, baseball plays in the East Yard Tournament at Burroughs. On Saturday, boys lacrosse takes on Thatcher School at Ojai at 2. And also on Saturday, varsity softball plays in the Woodbridge Varsity Tournament in Irvine. Track and field compete in the Simi Valley Invitational today and tomorrow. And they also have a meet of champions tomorrow at Azusa Pacific University.
University. All returning athletes, please join the Heart Athletics Google Classroom using the code MQBT. K Q E. If you're trying out Heart Cheer, don't forget that all paperwork is due by Friday, March 31st by noon. You can drop it off in the front office or in room E3. Today is the last day to get your tickets for Jump Your Socks Off. Tickets are $30 for four hours of bouncing from 4 to 8 p.m. this afternoon. This is a 50% discount overall. Buy your tickets at room C1 at brunch or lunch today, and a portion of the proceeds will help Hearts Yearbook. If you have any questions, contact Mrs. Ramirez at kramirez at heartdistrict.org. Attention seniors, the end of the school day today is the deadline to purchase your grad night tickets. Remember, you must turn in your permission slip at the time of purchase in the ASB office. We can't wait to see you all at Universal Studios celebrating your time at Heart High. Clubs! Amigos Unidos Latino Club meets today at lunch in room Q6. The Young Americans for Freedom Club is meeting today at lunch in room M5. Everyone is welcome. Film Club meets today at lunch in room F11. New members are welcome. Oh hey, just thought I'd let you know that the Procrastination Club has once again postponed our meeting. We'll meet later. Don't worry about it. See ya. Come check out Super Smash Bros. Club today at lunch in room T203. Please bring your own controllers if possible. Speech and Debate Club is meeting on Monday at lunch in Miss Nishioka's room F43. Please join us. New members are welcome. Now it's time for today's quote of the day. Buck at your love, buck at your life. Russell Robes. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's it for our show. Taking us out today is Ms. Burns' countdown number nine. Don't stop me now by Queen. Have a great bucket hat day. And, and stay, stay classy, classy heart. heart.